Let's examine this very nice mid-19th century book on the Sinai and Palestine, 1862, in an old 19th century half leather binding like so with marbled end papers, top edges gilt like this. It's a thick monumental book like so. It's very well preserved internally. There is this frontis here of a diagram, a cross section of uh, heights, land heights, mountain heights, elevations across Egypt, Sinai, and Palestine like so. And it's uh, by John Murray like this by Stanley. And here is the contents like this. Here's a list of the maps with some woodcuts, like so. And here's how the book survives internally. We see that the pages are clean and white. Here's a map of Egypt, like so, color lithographed. Then we have this map right here, which is very interesting as well, of the peninsula of the Sinai, right near the Red Sea there, like so. Yeah, the Gulf of Suez right there, Egypt over here, Arabian Peninsula there, and so on. Let's see, like this, right there, map of the traditional Sinai. And here's another one. Yes, there. It's very well illustrated with maps, like so. Like this one right here. There we have Palestine itself, right? It's a chromolithograph, color lithograph. And like this, we have this one. There's another one that's the south of Palestine. A little split to the top here, the fold line, like so. And like this, the index at the rear. You can see that it's very clean internally. There we are, Galilee. And like this, the Jordan and the Let's see. Okay. But uh, overall, well preserved. And uh, leather is supple, attractive looking, minor scuffing, rubbing, and so on. But still a handsome looking book from the 19th century. Monumental work, and it is available online now from me, Brian DeMambro.